Diabetic Foot Examination, Step-by-Step -step Guideline Diabetic foot examination is a crucial aspect of diabetes management, as people with diabetes are at a higher risk of developing foot-related complications. Here is a step-by-step -step guide to conducting a thorough diabetic foot examination. 1. Introduces yourself, meet and greet and introduce yourself by telling your name, your designation and what procedure you are going to do. 2. Take consent, take permission from patient before starting the examination. 3. Wash your hand, wash your hand before starting the examination. 4. Exposure, expose the both legs from foot to mid of thigh. 5. Inspection, begin by visually inspecting the feet, checking for any cuts, blisters, bruises, swelling, or redness. Also, look for any signs of fungal infections, such as discoloration or thickening of the skin. 6. Temperature test, using your hands, compare the temperature of both feet. Feet with poor circulation may feel cold in comparison to the other foot. 7. Sensitivity test, test the sensation in the feet using a monofilament or a tuning fork. If the patient has reduced sensation in their feet, it could be a sign of neuropathy. 8. Pulse check, check the pulse at the dorsal pedal and posterior tibial. If the pulse is weak, it may indicate poor circulation. 9. Muscle strength test, check the muscle strength in the feet and ankles by having the patient move their toes and feet up and down. Weakness in the feet and ankles may indicate muscle atrophy. 10. Range of motion test, check the range of motion in the feet and ankles by having the patient point and flex their toes. Reduced range of motion may indicate joint problems. 11. Nail examination, examine the nails for any fungal or bacterial infections, and check for ingrown toe nails. 12. Gait examination, assessment of the way the patient body moves, usually by walking from one place to another. 13. Footwear check, check the patient's footwear for proper fit and any signs of wear and tear that could lead to skin breakdown or injury. It is recommended to conduct a diabetic foot examination at least once a year, or more frequently if any problems are detected. Early detection and intervention can prevent serious foot-related complications in people with diabetes. Thanks for watching. This presentation is made by Dr. Mohammed Arsalan Khan Diabetic Specialist MBBS, MSc, Diabetic and Endocrinology CCDB MJAKURCP, London, 